Listen up, Normandy. This is your commander speaking. None of the other species has the guts, grit, or balls to deal with this. So it's up to us. We're the only ones who can stop Saren. I swear to you all, we will stop him. Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. Well, that was a big slap in the face on the other species, right? The captain's not here. I'm in charge now, Joker, and time's wasting. Get this bird in the air. Yes, ma'am. Not the commander we need, but the commander we deserve. Man, the driving in this game. One thing's for sure. It's absolutely better than cyberpunks. <laughs> Can you hear me out there? I'm trapped. I need help. Quit shouting. This place is crawling with geth. Sorry. How did you get in here? I didn't think there was any way past the barrier. Superior firepower. <laughs> we blasted through with the mining laser. Of course. Yes. That oh, I thought sense. she was talking about herself. Please. Kill this bastard. We don't have time to deal with this idiot. Charge! <laughs> Normandy isn't equipped to land in exploding volcanoes. They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for future reference. Don't lecture me, boy. There and your pilot is making jokes. He's a jerk. Sometimes Joker's a real ass. Just try to ignore him. I see. It must be a human thing. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. No, I can give but you I experience. To you. I'd feel safer if you let me stay on your ship. And her biotics will come in handy when the fighting starts. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Another alien. <laughs> Karen, come on. You gotta chill a bit. Aren't we going for diversity here? It's so weird. It's actually like a little bit physically hurting me that I'm being so mean. And these characters don't even exist. Goes to show you that it really takes effort to be mean to somebody. And I guess it takes talent. Because this shit is hard. I'm sure your letters home are very poignant. Just keep this kind of sentimentality out of the CIC. Yes, ma'am. Sorry to have wasted your time. Oh, not this bit. I, I know things are different aboard the Normandy, but uh, I'm I'm concerned about the aliens. The oh boy, rights. here we go. With all due respect, Commander. Should they have full access to the ship? I don't think we should give them free reign to poke around the vital systems, engines, sensors, weapons. Oh my God, I'm so conflicted. Are Karens racist? Not necessarily, right? I'm actually gonna Google that. Are Karens <laughs> evil, narcissist, self aware, mean, Gen X, annoying soccer moms? Are Karens racist? It actually has a, a Wikipedia page. Karen is actually a term now. Speak to the manager. Being, oh, okay. Being racist. Being anti vax. No inclusivity. No diversity here. Karen's just straight up racist. I share your concerns, Chief, but I'm under orders. Humanity, I mean. We have to learn to rely on ourselves. Ah, uh, what's the most racist response here? As noble as the council members seem now, if their backs are against the wall, They'll abandon us. Who well, actually cares about yeah, the council? The council's had a grudge against us since the first contact war. I don't think it's a grudge. I think it's... Look, if you're fighting a bear and the only way for you to survive is to sick your dog on it and run, you'll do it. As much as you love your dog, it isn't human. Huh. It's not racism, not really. Members of their species will always be more important to them than humans are. Is that actually true? I mean, that's an interesting question. We're slowly going to turn into an existential slash morality video here, but that, that analogy is kind of interesting. If there's 16 zombies coming for your ass, would you have the balls to stab your dog in the neck just for your fat ass to get away? Probably not, right? Unless you're like with somebody, like your family or loved one, and you have to save them. Then you would probably have to do that choice. 
I know that's obviously not her point, but Jesus, what do you guys think? Man, Karen doesn't like you, Ashley. But you guys share the same view, so. All right, I can see where your concerns are coming from, Williams. But this is a multilateral mission. You're gonna have to work with aliens, like it or not. It won't be a problem, Commander. Hello, Krogan. I ain't got time for you, boy. Geth, wait for no one. They're preparing another attack. Please, up the stairs past the freighter. Wait. Take cover! Jesus, dude! Let me ease your suffering. Oh my god, it's... It's my sister. <laughs> Susan Shepard. What are you doing here? She's stuck in time. What happened? She just got tricked into eating meat. Now she's contemplating on life. You're a bit late, aren't you? Arcelia. Sorry, Commander. How dare you? Everyone's on edge since... Watch out! Go, Geth. Kill this bitch. Here you go, Fast and the Furious 27, right here. Hello, pussy. Relax, Jong. They're obviously not Geth. Yeah, Jong. Who are you? What do you want? I suggest you put that weapon down unless you're ready to use it. If, if that's the way it has to be, heck, come on, come on! Yeah, same outcome. As if we don't have enough problems. Now we're shooting each other in the back. No, I shot him it's in the face. Fault. The colonists won't let you near the Thorian. They die first. They're under its control. Anything that gets between me and my goal is fair game. There's got to be another way. I'm not stopping to ask them to breathe deeply. How can it hurt to try? Please, Commander. These are our friends. No. Is there any consequences to doing this shit? No. I'm not doing it. At least take the grenades so you have the option. Do the right thing, Commander. Please. The Geth. Wait, no. What do you call these? The meat eaters. Nothing hostile lives to take a second shot. I hear that. But what about those nerve grenades we jury rigged with Bainham? We don't have time to waste on these people. There's a galaxy at stake. Very well, Commander. If that's what you want. <laughs> How dare these puny people? <laughs> How dare them? They're they turn into mindless zombies, I'm sorry. <laughs> Karen don't give a shit. Ah, finally. Got to smack you in the face. Huh? Huh? Where are these goddamn colonists? Leave no one alive. There's two more. Find those two. That's your mama's pussy. All I saw were more weird visions. It still <laughs> didn't make sense. <laughs> what is that? Gift. See, there's still more of you. Who's the two survivors? Is it you? You? Oh no, it's not me, dog. What are you talking about, dog? X05, Neil. Time to execute. Caden, go for it. Execute this motherfucker. Alright, let's get out of here. <gasps> Is that Susan? Susan! Sister! <laughs> Alright, where are we going next? Vormir? Wait, not Vormir. That's from Avengers. <laughs> Fuck. We're gonna go get the Soul Stone. Imagine this place and the remaster gonna be way more improved they're gonna add two more pixels of texture John Wick There's 
scientist salarians. Garrus. I'm concerned about Red. Can we still trust him? That depends if I have enough renegade points. Jesus, dude. You want to go right now? Rex. I don't want to lose you, man, but this is Karen we're talking about. This base can't be destroyed. I won't allow it. Saren doesn't care about these Krogan. They're tools, puppets. He'll destroy them as soon as they're no longer useful to him. Is that what you want for your people? All right, Shepard. Oh, thank Make God. Point. I don't like this, but I trust you enough to follow your lead. I shouldn't have doubted you, Karen. Jesus Christ, thank you. He saved the day. Nice work with Rex. I didn't think anything would calm him down. Well, I had to make a deal with him. You have to spend the night with him, bro. I'm sorry. That's all I can... That's all I can say. You gotta bet the Krogan. Just one time. Take it... Take one for the team, baby. Wait, so whoever you take... Wait, whoever you choose... Whoever you choose will die? The most logical choice for Karen here is to save Ashley because she's racist, right? Hey, Katie. Alenko, you're with the captain. Keep it simple. Understood? Aye, aye, Commander. We need some music in here to make it more... Yeah, there we go. Thank you. Something scrambled. Let me out. Huh. No. I can't take that chance. Can't take that chance. No chance. I need to do what it says. I have to. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Let Jesus, out. dude. Holy shit, dude. Don't shoot. Please, I just want to get out of here before it's too late. Ashley Killer. You conducted brutal experiments on helpless test subjects. You helped Saren. You don't get to live. I just did what I was told. I didn't have a choice. I'm sorry. Sorry doesn't help your victims. No, no! <laughs> You are not Saren. What is that? Is that corpse? Is that kind of VI interface? You touch my mind, fumbling in ignorance, incapable of understanding. Jesus Christ, that's corpse husband. Alright, enough chit chat, Sovereign. Where's the manager? His voice was on like maximum bass. He talks like this. I will destroy you, humans. All you humans will perish because I am eternal. We are your destroyer. <laughs> it's done, Commander. Go get the lieutenant and get the hell out of here. Belay that. We can handle ourselves. Go back and get Williams. Oh, here we go. I remember the first time that I reached this point. I had to take an hour Williams. break. Radio just to Joker decide who. To meet us at the bomb site. Yes, Commander, I... It's the right choice, and you know it, Ash. Ah, oh no, Caden. Anyway. Fight hard, Lieutenant. Die proud. Aye, aye, Commander. Oh no, Caden, no! Anyway. <laughs> so I started blasting. <laughs> Oh no! How dare you touch me! I can't believe Caden didn't make it. How could we just leave him down there? I did what I had to do. Do not question my orders. I'm... I'm sorry, Commander. You saved my life. I'm grateful for that. But it should have been me. Just listen to that sad music in the background, man. I feel like I have to do a... A sad speech here. It is truly a sad episode. We lost one life for Karen Shepard had to choose between the boring human squad mate 
and the racist. Naturally, Ashley is the one to be chosen by Commander Karen Shepard. It had to be done. And while the sad music is playing in the background, I ask you, if you like this video, hit that like button right now. And if you want to see more of Karen's adventures as the ultimate badass protagonist, subscribe. And with that, Karen Shepard and August First Class here, signing out. Peace, 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 peace. Peace, peace.